K. A molecule absorbs energy and becomes excited. It does not lose this energy in one big jump, back to base, but several little steps. Thus generates little photons. If in the visible region, then it glows. Here loss is by radiative decay. An electron relaxes back into a lower energy orbital, generating photons. Two types of radiative decay exist, fluorescence and phosphorescence. Fluorescence. The spontaneously emitted radiation ceases immediately after the exciting radiation is extinguished. Hence, an immediate conversion of absorbed light into emitted energy. Phosphorescence. Spontaneous emission may persist for a long period. Could be hours, but normally seconds. Storage of energy in a reservoir from which it slowly leaks. Here is the diagram to show how fluorescence occurs. In singlet S0 absorbs energy and becomes excited and goes to singlet S1. So that is absorption, then may leak downwards by step there and so on and so on. It continues to leak until it gets to the lowest vibrational level of S1. From there then, it can jump back to singlet S0, giving fluorescence. This diagram is known as the Jablonski diagram. On the other hand, we can again have absorption at singlet S0 and go to singlet S1 or S2 or S3. But during the leaking, we might have an intersystem crossover from the singlet system to the triplet system, which is slightly lower in energy. Now, in the, slight, in the triplet system, we still can have leaks occurring until we come to the lowest level, vibrational level, and then we can jump back to singlet S0. That's phosphorescence occurring. Again, this is a Jablonski diagram, but it has both fluorescence in blue and phosphorescence in red. Transitions between energy levels of molecular states. Molecules in the ground state S0 absorbs energy H nu and may become excited to states S1 or S2, as mentioned earlier. Molecules may occupy any of the vibrational levels in the excited state. Emission is usually from the lowest vibrational level, V equals naught, and molecules usually get there by internal conversion, IC. If a molecule is demoted to lower or promoted to higher vibrational level, there is an energy difference. Primary absorption process. Frank Condon's principle operates. Transitions to higher levels take place in 10 to the minus 15 seconds. This time is so short that nuclear configuration is retained. Vibrational kinetic energy and momentum are also retained. In other words, we can draw straight lines to represent the absorption and emission of energy or the transitions. Changes in vibration and Rotational energies usually occur on transition to higher electronic levels. Usually, spin is conserved, i.e. remains singlet. Let us look at fluorescence in a little bit of detail. If there is no collision within 10 to the minus 8 to 10 to the minus 9 seconds, we may get fluorescence. This could be resonance fluorescence, where lambda fluorescence is equal to lambda absorption where energies are equal. We have resonance energy, e.g. 
Mercury exciting radiation is 253.7 nanometers and emits radiation 253.7 nanometers, as shown in the diagram here. Absorption, S0 to S1. Emission, S1 to S0. And these are vibrational levels in S0, and those are vibrational levels in S1. It can also involve, involve lambda fluorescence greater than lambda absorbance. This would involve internal conversion first, e.g. absorbing UV and radiating visible. Here is an example. S0 absorption there, then internal conversion to that, then get back to that. Quenching. Intermolecular collisions quench fluorescence. Therefore, pressure and temperature have an effect on fluorescence. Increasing pressure increases collision frequency and hence deactivation probability. As shown in the diagram here, if that is representing fluorescence, and this is either temperature or pressure, as the temperature increases, fluorescence goes down that way. Similarly, as pressure increases, again fluorescence will decrease. Photosensitization. Sometimes collisions may transfer energy from one excited molecule to a different molecule, which then fluoresces. 